Next on Melbourne's amazing walks is Swanston Street. Now this is up the uni section of Melbourne. There's lots of unis, universities and stuff up here. Starting off at the State Library. This is the rebuilt library after the last one got swallowed up in the, uh, the Great Earthquake of 1943. So this is the remnants of, of uh, the old library still standing this day. So the other one was swiftly erected at that point in time in order to uh, uh, give the Victorians back the library access that they needed after the earthquake. So it's a nice old building. Have a look. It's a nice place to come and relax and eat some lunch, hang out, you know, in between subjects and stuff at school. So, as you can see, other people are admiring the, uh, the newly rebuilt library after the old one got swallowed. A couple of statues up here, you know, again, some more folks lounging about. So, we uh, progress down, a few eateries and stuff along the way. You can see it's mainly a university sort of crowd. Yeah, yeah. Lots of uh, things to see and do. You know, for, for those religiously uh, favourable, there's a church. Let me come up to uh, some of the major shops down here. Got things, uh, department stores and so forth. Hello, Melbourne Tram. There's the white one that travels around, and his brother, the blue one. So, as we progress down, going past a few backpackers that seem to be around this area as well. And I think it's because of the, uh, the cheap drink prices from the university. So, continue down, coming into the sort of uh, little, little Greece slash Little China area where there's a lot of restaurants and stuff. You know, we still, being Australian, have a quite a touch of America upon us as well. You can see our, uh, it used to be number one favorite uh, American coffee store, Starbucks there with the GFC, all of the other um, major Starbucks closed down. So, well actually, let me just stop back here. As you can see, it's a bit of a quirky sort of uh, mall area into the Big W and so forth, which is again the department store. And a bit of rush for the moment because we've got to cross the lights before they change. And the police are coming up here. Uh, still looking. Okay. There's the DHL, another American icon. There's the double white tram. Moons around the city. Okay, so up this way is Little Greece. And then there's uh, Little America. Cruise along, there's a few more shops around here. Uh, a lot of, a lot of uh, Malaysian, Thai, Chinese, Vietnamese restaurants along here. As we're heading to uh, uh, Little China, you see there's an ANZ on the corner which typifies that. I'll catch that another time. We'll do a proper search around there. But, um, lots of terraces, nice places to drink. You can see up there, there's a few people lucky enough to be enjoying the day today. <laughs> so, here's the funny little uh, photo joints that they have around. There's a nice Thai food restaurant for everyone to sponsor street. There's a bit of uh, work happening there. There's a few 7-Eleven uh, style places. These are the, uh, the break loose ones. So there's the ANC that heads into Little China. We'll do a little quick view up the street. So it's 
quite nice up there. You always get a good feed. Okay, we'll continue onwards. Okay, souvenirs. Another American outlet, I think they are. Oh, there's, there's something for the adults if you're ever down this way. Swiss joints, what's that? So, here's the other Starbucks that's down here. So, getting through the street, nearly at the end of this uh, virtual tour, we'll uh, do a big spin around down to the Burke Street intersection, which is where I just came from before for the, uh, the Burke Street Mall review. So you get lots of little uh, vendors around, making their wares and stuff. So let's do a bit of a spin, finish off this trip down Burke Street. So there's Crazy John. Paul drives no longer, and here's the Burke Street Mall, where we were before, there's a tram repair truck, Burke Street Mall again, Telstra, um, that's it, and there's the great tram. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, tour of Swanson Street down the Burke Street. Tune in again and there'll be more streets of our lovely town updated. See ya.